Hello, I'm James Clark from the Department of Physiology at King's College London and in this short tutorial I'm just going to show you some quick and easy ways of using Poll Everywhere while giving a live lecture. Those of you who have tried to use Poll Everywhere within your PowerPoint presentations will know that these don't often work within Teams while presenting through the Teams window. I'm not quite sure what the technical problem is, but it means that when you present your poll, they don't seem to be active and therefore they don't get presented to the students. One way to get around this is what I'm doing here, which is presenting my lecture through Teams. And you can see there was a red box around my question slide on diving physiology. And you can see that this is what I'm presenting through Teams. I would normally do this on two monitors, but for the simplicity for this short tutorial, I'm doing it on one monitor. What I've got down the bottom of my screen is my Poll Everywhere account open on the BSC Diving questions. And I've got a small number of questions that I might want to ask my students over the course of the lecture during these little breaks. And the first question I want to ask them at this point is this question here. You have to go diving to get decompression sickness. At the moment, no students have answered this question, and you can see that I've selected to show responses in Poll Everywhere, and uh, obviously it's not active at the moment. Normally, when you present this in PowerPoint, this will automatically activate, and then you're able to ask students to log in to pollev.com forward slash your username, and they'll be able to answer the question. But this doesn't always work through Teams, and certainly it's not worth risking it and then getting no responders. So, how do we do this? Well, you go to the right-hand window within your Poll Everywhere instance. Click on Present and choose Share. Now you've got the option to share the response link. If you click on this little thing here, it'll copy it to the paste buffer, or you can select this entire URL. Now you can paste in the chat window of your team session that the students will see a link to the poll. Now the students can see a link to my first Poll Everywhere question. Any student that is part of this live session can now click on the link. It will open up the Poll Everywhere audience participation panel. My internet's a bit slow today. There we go. And you'll see the question. You have to go diving to get decompression illness. If I make that box smaller so I can see the response on the bottom left of my screen and click on false, you'll see I've now got a response from one student, namely me. Once I'm happy with this, I can leave that open for a few minutes and allow students to respond. Now I can go to the right side of my window and open up a different question if I so wish. I can go to present, share, and copy the link and now I can paste the second question into my chat window. Now students can click on the second link and I can choose an answer. I can then look at the responses in the window and see that one student has chosen that answer. If I want to I can then show the correct answer which is actually 1.26. You'll notice that the student will not see the correct answer in this window. So in order to share it with the student, the best thing to do is then have the answers in your PowerPoint presentation to then share the students the correct answers. And that's very easy to do, simply listing the questions and posting the answers. So this is one way of getting a Poll Everywhere poll or multiple Poll Everywhere polls distributed to a live student cohort while giving a PowerPoint presentation. I hope it's helped. If you found this tutorial useful, please consider subscribing to my YouTube channel.